my Christmas haul. I have so much stuff that I collected last week that I really wanted to share with you guys. I decided to go a little bit more all out for Christmas this year because with everything going on in our lives, we really didn't have the opportunity to decorate for Halloween or really do it up the way that I always like to decorate my house. So I wanted to definitely give my girls the best Christmas house that they can have this year. So I went out, I bought more Christmas decor than what I already have. If you guys see my previous videos, you know I do have quite a collection or I'm starting to at least get quite a collection of Christmas decor. So I bought just a little bit more for the house. So let's go ahead and jump right in because I feel like it's gonna be a lengthy video and then I have the two girls right in the living room. Um, so I have to get this done. So let's start off with Walmart. I picked up some more greeneries for the house. I just felt like when I was looking at my old video that I definitely wanted more greens in the house this year. So the first thing I picked up was this nine foot um, garland. It is so pretty. It was only $6 and I just feel like it is so, so nice. They have flocked ones, they have uh, the pre-lit ones, they have like so many to pick from Walmart. So definitely go to Walmart and get the garlands before they're gone because I do know every year that they are a very hot item and I always pick them up like honestly before Halloween because I always know that they do sell out. So um, the first one I got was this one. I don't really know where I'm going to put it yet but obviously I'm gonna put it somewhere in the house. And then the next one is this 18 foot uh, pre-lit pine garland. This was only $12.98 and I actually think I'm going to put this in my bedroom this year. I think that it is so pretty and it's going to look really nice in my bedroom because I have a really good vision in my head. Um, so I picked up this one. I have so many of these. I think I have like five of them downstairs in the basement that I use every year. And then this was something that I was really, really excited to find. I didn't even know that like they even had them and I think I found them by accident but I think they're so pretty. It is these little, I don't even know what you call them, bow decor. How pretty is that? It looks like it's from like Hobby Lobby or like Michaels or somewhere. Like the, it's so, so pretty and look at the price of it. How cheap is that? So I picked up two of these. They were the only two left and I figured I would grab them because I'm not quite sure where I'm going to put them yet, but I think they are so, so pretty. And you guys know, if you guys watch my videos or if you're new, I really love traditional red and green and white Christmas. Like that's just my absolute favorite. I'm not more of like a white person. I'm definitely more of like the true Christmas colors. Um, but a, this right here, is like so me so my style so this was like perfect for me another wreath i got was just this plain one uh like i said i really don't know what i'm gonna do with it but i like just having them in the house because you just never know what you need it for or what you're gonna do with it it's very plain it needs to be fluffed it needs to be done like it's like so boring right now but this was only 280 and it was like so perfect and they're just like I said, they're nice to have because you never know what you're going to need them for. This one is my absolute favorite. I think it's so pretty. Look at this. I love this. This is so beautiful. This was only $12.98 as well. Kind of makes me want to go back to Walmart today by like sharing all this stuff with you guys because I love everything. And this is just so, so cute. I love this. I don't know where I'm going to put it. Maybe I'll put it on like my door or something like the basement door of the house, but I just think that this is so pretty and such good quality for 12 bucks. You can't beat it. And I thought this was really cute. It says season greetings. Um, I think that this was, yeah, 3 dollars I'm not gonna be able to share the prices with everything in this video um, because Walmart's just convenient and everything is priced, but I'll try my best to share all the prices with you guys. And then another little thing that I got from Walmart was this super cute tree. I love this. I think it's going to be so cute on like my little coffee bar or something. And then that was only $2.78. So you cannot beat that. And now I need to go back to Walmart. Moving on to Marshalls. So Marshalls really didn't have much. And I actually feel like since COVID, um, my Marshalls really doesn't like stock up on things like they used to. I don't know if it's like they're having a problem getting stuff in or what's going on, but like I've been having such a hard time finding things at Marshalls lately. And it might be too because I'm not getting there till like three o'clock because with both girls, I cannot get out of the house until like one o'clock. Um, so that might be a reason why I'm having a more harder time finding things, but I did find some things. 
Um, and they're mostly for my coffee bar because I really wanted to change up my coffee bar this year. Um, and then I got a really cute piece too. So I got this really cute pillow. It's really long and it says Mary on it. I love how simple it is and how pretty it is. And this was really cheap. This was only $16.99 and I just love, love, love this. I think that this is so cute. I picked up these Ray Dunn cups because these are so cute and so perfect for the coffee bar and they have the little old fashioned truck on it. And then they also came with the little um, cozy things. I don't know what they're called. What are they called? Oh, the sleeves. Um, so they say Merry Christmas and then the cup says Merry Christmas. And I don't think that they're mixed. I think that they're all the same, but these were $4.99. I also picked these up for the coffee bar because these are just like so cute for just sitting like in the little tier thing. Um, I got these cocoa latte stirrers and these are so cute. Adam loves these. These were $4.99. I get these like every year. And then I also got these Harry and David hazelnut wafer rolls and I just thought the jar was actually really pretty so that's why I got these because I just love the way that they looked and then these were $2.99 so they were really cheap and they're like perfect little fill-ins and then I also got this candle because I am obsessed with the lid this lid is like so so cute and this is what it looks like how cute is that I love the old-fashioned Santa like so cute it's the sand and fog one um, that I feel like everybody gets from Marshalls and this is winter pine and it smells so so good pine is my favorite smell in the entire world pine and marshmallow mm. they should make a marshmallow pine candle that would be like right up my alley so the other day Adeline and Ellie and I were at my mom's house and I had to run to the dollar store for something and while I was in the dollar store, I found so much cute stuff, like so much cute stuff. So this is all from the Dollar General. And like I am amazed at the stuff I found. I got this cute little snowman. How cute is he? I love him. I feel like I need to add like stuff like this, like a cute snowman, Santa Claus, and stuff like that. Because I have two little girls and I really like making my house feel special to them like the holidays are for kids so that's why i like blending in this kind of stuff so i picked up this cute little snowman he is adorable he was only five dollars he was so so cheap and then i got this so so pretty i am obsessed with this ice skate how cute is this like i said i don't know where i'm gonna put it but i am in love and that was only three dollars but i love 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 this and then i got another little gnome for my little gnome collection because how cute is he and he looks like he's from like marshall's or something and he was only three dollars as well and the cutest go to your local what is this called dollar general because they got the cutest christmas stuff and then I also picked up these two little ornaments because I can never find an A and an E together and I finally did. So I got these little ornaments and they're so cute. I love them. I'm going to hang on from somewhere. And then I also got this serving tray because I don't have that many serving trays and we have uh, Christmas Eve here every year. So I wanted a serving tray for either Christmas Eve and we also do Christmas morning here too. So um either breakfast or christmas eve or i could just use it twice and wash it and then i also got this old fashioned one i love this because i my, my mom has tons of these metal trees and i cannot ever find these metal trees and i found it at the dollar store so this was perfect and one dollar i love this i think it's so pretty the last thing that i got from the dollar store was this uh buffalo check fleece blanket I think I am going to put this on my front porch and it was only $5. So if it gets ruined, like with the snow, the rain, whatever goes on outside, um, it was only $5 and it's super cute. It looks super comfy. So I think I'm going to put it on like my chair and this is perfect for outside. Okay. Moving on to Target. My Target has been 
terrible with the Christmas stuff. Every time I go to Target, I cannot find anything. Everything stinks. I really, really, really want the uh, cookie canisters that say like, uh, I think they say Santa's cookies or cookies for Santa, something like that. Um, I really, really want them, but I feel like I'm not going to get them this year. So if you um, watch my videos and you are from like my area, please let me know if you find them um, and I'll like Venmo you or something. But um, I cannot find them for anything. But I did find some good stuff, so let me show you what I got from Target. I picked up one of these trees because I picked up a few last year and I used them. And I feel like you can just fill these in like all over your house. And this was only $5. I need more because once I got home, I was like, oh, I can put a tree there. I can put a tree there. Um, so I definitely need to go pick up more trees. And I gotta put a pasty in. Be right back. Okay, I am back. So I got that tree. And then another thing that I got was this cute Merry Christmas sign. I love this. I think it's so, so cute. And it was so cheap. It was only $5. And either a little cute somewhere in here so I got that and then this was something that I've been wanting since last year they came out with this last year um and then I couldn't find it last year but I got to, uh, to find one this year was one of these days until Christmas signs I love this and I love the little slider wreath like how you like slide it how cute love 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 this it's so so cute so I can't wait to decorate with this and then this was one of the things that I really, really, really wanted from Target. Um, and I'm so happy I got it. And I actually think I'm going to buy another one today. Um, this. How cute is this? I love this. So my mom and I collect the uh, mugs from Pottery Barn. Every year we get a new one. And she's probably going to be mad at me when she watches this video because I bought another one yesterday. I couldn't help it. So, um... I need another one though so she can buy me two of them so she can buy me like another one but anyway so um this looks like the pottery barn mugs to me like i feel like that's like the vibe that they're going with is like the pottery barn ones so i love this i think that this is so cute and he's going to look adorable on my coffee bar so definitely had to pick him up i think he needs some whipped cream though i'm gonna um try to figure out how to make that like fake whipped cream stuff because I think little fake whipped cream would look super cute on that. So that is it from Target. Now moving on to Hobby Lobby. I'm actually going to go back to Hobby Lobby today because I had a few more things in mind and then I started like getting like ideas off of Pinterest and stuff. And then I was like, oh, I need this, I need that. So I'm gonna head to Hobby Lobby today to get a few more things. But I got, I only wanted this ornament. How cute is this? So I got add on this ornament. And then I got one of these little wreaths. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this set yet. If I'm gonna hang it up as actually like a wreath or if I'm gonna use it as a, candle holder like but with a smaller candle on like a coffee table or like on my kitchen island something so I'm gonna figure out what to do with this and then I got this I think I'm gonna return I actually was just talking to my mom about this too I got this a uh, long red um table runner but something is just like throwing me off with it I'm not quite sure why because everything that I pick out is like the buffalo check and everything but when I was to Marshalls, I felt like I just found like such cuter ones that after I bought this, I was like, I just bought like a plain red one. I don't know though. I, I guess I'll figure it out. Um, but I think I'm going to exchange this for something different. I just don't know what yet. So this is tentative. I don't know if I'm keeping that or not. And then I also got, oh, I know one more of these. So I got this for my coffee bar too. I bought one of these risers and it was only $3.99 with, oh, everything from Hobby Lobby 2 is 50% off. Um, but I bought it for like a riser. So like you can sit like a gnome on it, like, so like it lifts it up or you can put like this little tree on there. Like whatever you have to do to like rise things up on your coffee bar, because I feel like when you're decorating, you need like different like heights. So that's why I got this. And I'm definitely gonna pick up another one because I didn't realize how hard they were to find. Um, so I'm gonna grab another one if I see that. And then that is it 
for Hobby Lobby. I got some new Ray Dunn pieces and I actually just took a poll on Instagram because are we over Ray Dunn or are we still collecting it like I am? Because I'm still obsessed with it. I think Ray Dunn is just so cool and I just love the way that it looks. So I'm going to keep collecting it, but you know, I don't know if it's, is it so cool? Is it not cool? But I did get some really cool stuff. I got this Santa mug with the little hat and it is just to die for i have been dying for one of these and i could not find one forever so i finally found one and i am just in love with it this is like one of my prized possessions so it is going to go high on my shelf so no little fingers can touch it and then i also got a fa la la la, -la bowl and i'm going to put this probably over by my coffee bar too and I love this. It's so cute and it's going to fit in with the rest of my collection for Christmas and I'm just so excited to decorate. And then the one random thing that I got but I want to share with you guys because I think they're really cool this year are the Santa Bells. I actually got these from Lowe's. I went with Mike a couple nights ago and I just really wanted a pair of Santa Bells. Uh, the, the, not bells, those bells. <laughs> so I got a Santa bell thing and I'm going to hang it on one of the doors. I'm probably going to put it on the front door so every time somebody comes in we can hear it and I just love these. I feel like these are so cool to have and like they just sound so pretty. They sound like Christmas. So that is it for my haul. I hope you guys enjoy. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button and turn on your bell for notifications because next week I am going to start uploading Christmas decor videos. I 1000% am decorating this house. I am so excited. We need all the Christmas spirit we can get in this house this year. So it's going to be the best Christmas ever. And I'm going to make sure that I make it the best Christmas ever. So I will see you guys in another video. Bye.